It's human nature to want to change our surroundings once in a while, and that keeps paper hangers in business. Paper hangers cover interior walls and ceilings with many different types of decorative paper or fabric. Though the wallpaper is usually selected by the client, it's up to the paper hanger to take measurements and calculate how many rolls and how much adhesive will be needed to cover the area. This worker uses specialized tools, chemicals, and a lot of elbow grease to prep the walls, removing imperfections and old materials. Then the transformation begins, strip by precisely trimmed strip. Patterns are carefully matched, and the surface is smoothed of all bumps and wrinkles so that the final result is seamless. It's a very physical profession. Paper hangers need stamina, good balance, and strong arms. Much of the work is done overhead. But since the jobs are usually indoors, the work environment is generally comfortable, and jobs are available all year. Many experienced paper hangers are self-employed and work alone, choosing their own hours. Being an assistant is a good route to a career in this field, though some vocational schools offer training. Paper hangers can affect the one change in a room that can have the most visual impact.